Alrighty, we are back and we are at the Grand Archives and we are ready and roaring to go. And of course we use the key. Give me just a second, guys. Alright, sorry about that. Uh, we did use the Grand Archives key. <clears throat> so this is actually quite a big area, and there um, is our other sage. So there were, if you noticed earlier, there were two um, sages, the sage twins, or I don't know if they're twins, but um, there were two. And we fought one as a boss, and this one is kind of like a mini-boss, I guess. Um, he's not quite a mini-boss, he's just kind of a, an annoyance that is running around the stage, um, shooting at you until you get pretty far in. Um, and he's actually, I believe, up there somewhere? I don't, I don't actually remember where he is specifically, but... We will see him again, that's for sure. Yeah, and then these guys are all over the place in this level, which I hate. I hate these little thrall enemies. There's another chunk, just in case you are not plus nine yet. And then we come this way. Yeah, so there's lots of stuff like items and stuff in this area. And then there are these weird ass enemies, which are like sorcerers, pyromancy, but they have like waxy candle heads. They're very weird. Hmm. Yeah, I can see his little fabric through there. He's right there. He's up on that little ledge, I suppose. All right, we'll take out candle heads here. Yeah, see, so they are at least in a small sense. Um, no. Sorcerers, for sure. And I honestly don't have any idea what dunking your head in wax does. So I really kind of don't, I don't do it. I haven't done it in a while in this area. Just because I don't, I have no clue what it does. I and mean, it doesn't seem to have any kind of effect. Um, I'm sure it does in some vague sense. I mean, oh, it does this, I'm sure. I haven't seen any effect for it, so not personally anyway. No, no, god damn it. Fucking knights, man. Yeah, fuck you. It's just so annoying sometimes. It's Ember, and then we will go back in there, and we'll kind of run through it, because now we've had a feel for the area a little bit. Alright, so we took a little bit more off of him, but not too much. Um, we don't need to go that way. We need to come this way. Wee. There we go. All right, let's kick this guy's ass. Deal so much damage. Whoa! I don't know that I've ever seen them do that before. I don't know that I've ever seen them buff like that. Oh! 
when you die. Bam! Wow, that was kind of a badass way to die, but still. Ooh, not Lothric Knight Great Shield. Groovy. Grab an item. Crystal Chime. Just picking up all the things. Alright, we're gonna go ahead and chug an Estus. And uh, we're not gonna go that way. We're gonna go up here and over here. Got a scale. We're gonna go over here. And then we're gonna kill this thrall enemy. And grab that. And now we can continue. Yeah, nope, nope, nope. All of you are assholes, nope. All right. So this is when things start to get kind of weird, and you see the the small, very small gimmick of this area. So yeah, I have no idea what these are supposed to be. They're obviously some kind of cursed, like spell, I suppose, spell books. Um, because obviously they curse you. Um, twinkling and a chaos gem uh, but they don't just curse you they do deal damage over time as you stand near them so we're, yeah we're getting a whole bunch of twinkling titanite down here I don't think there's anything else but yeah there's they're like kind of like traps for this area and they kind of they remind me of Seath's arms like Seath the scaleless from uh, the first Dark Souls. So they might be enemies that are like little throwbacks, I suppose, but I don't exactly know what the hell they are. Nor do I really... I mean, I definitely do want to know. Oh, whoa! Is that their backstab, or did he just, like, grab me? I don't think any of those enemies has ever done that to me before. Why are you a thing? I died. I can't believe I did that. I've never done that before. God damn it. Alright, well... Alright, hold on. Oh, that's dealt with. Freaking people, I swear. Alright, sorry about that, guys. Um, I may just take that little chunk of, of just nothing out of this episode. Wow, that fucking hurt a ton. I don't... I may have gotten him. 
All right, we'll try and get back up to where I was pretty quick here. Because we don't really have to explore anything because I got most of the items. All right. Chunk Butamus, Butamus, Butamus. No. Oh my god, I cannot believe I just fucking died. God damn it. Well, there goes like 30 grand in souls. As usual, I'm not paying enough fucking attention. Piss off! Yeah, I didn't. I know for a fact I didn't get him that time. Back up there and kick the fucking sage's ass. If we can, because we only have like a couple minutes left. Or I only have a couple minutes left. Come here. I don't want you following me. Yeah, screw you, Crystal Sage. All right, after we kill these enemies, we... Oh, God damn it. Whoa! Oh, my good God. I've never died this much in this area. All right, we're going to end the episode there. On irritation. Alright guys, but like what I said, I'm going to end the episode there and uh, we'll pick it up here again in a minute. I need a second. I need a break. I need just, not even like a second, just like two minutes. <sighs> Alright. Bye guys. Oh, wait. Wait, wait, wait. Mm.